Hello! Welcome to Kaiju 101 with yours truly, Professor Kaiju. Today, I'm going to be playing Pokemon Red. Now, I may have... There might be some random person out there or skeptic who might be... You might say something along the lines of... Hey, Professor, uh, why are you playing Pokemon? Aren't you supposed to be doing things like giant monsters like Godzilla and Ken Kong and Camera? Why aren't you playing those? Well... You know, kaiju... The word kaiju is a Japanese word that technically means strange creature or strange beast. And I gotta say, Pokemon? They're kind of strange. I mean, look at that one. Or this one, or... Ah! Oh god! Jeez! Get her away! Go! Ugh. Ugh. Oh, god. Really disturbing. But no. Pokemon to me are definitely kaiju related, and it's one of the most long-running series and successful fr uh, blah, 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 kaiju franchises out there to date. And last year was its 20th anniversary, and it would have been really cool if I had done something with this earlier, so it could have fallen along with 2016, but you know, sometimes you don't always get what you want. So anyway, today I'm going to be doing a Nuzlocke challenge, because uh, those are popular. And... Uh, and get the cool kids do them all the time. So I... To anyone who might have been living in a, under a rock their entire lives, or this could very well be your first Nuzlocke challenge, in which case, thank you for joining me. Thank you for choosing me as your first Nuzlocke challenge person. Um, I don't understand why. You probably had a lot of better people to choose for me, but thank you. I very much appreciate it. So Nuzlocke Challenge, you basically got two major rules. One, if your Pokemon faints, it's gone. It's dead. You either have two options. You can just release it, straight up release it, or you can put it in specially marked PC so that you can see your giant wall of failure. I'm just going to be releasing them because it's just easier and I don't care. Number two, every time you hit a new area you can catch the very first Pokemon, and only the very first Pokemon that you encounter. And that's it. If you happen to knock out that one Pokemon, you can't get anything from there. So that fucking sucks. I'm also going to be doing uh, Duplicate Claws, which, say, you hit Route... whatever, you hit Route 1, you get a Rattata. Okay, cool, you get your next Route, Route 2. It's another Rattata. Basically, you keep going until you find a new Pokemon that you haven't caught before. So, I'll be implementing that. And that's that's about it. Nuzlocke Challenge. It's basically Pokemon on hardcore mode. Anyway, let's start this thing, because I'm a little tired. And I want to get this, get this thing done. New game. Hmm. Alright, cool. Let's go. Let's do it. Ah, Professor Oak. Jeez Louise, it's really been 20 years since I first saw you. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Prof. This world's inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. Oh dear God, look at that freak. For some people, they're pets. Others, they use them in illegal fights myself. Well, I have quite a hmm, interest in them. Uh, first, what is your name, young child? Oh yeah, also I'm doing a theme. Uh, my theme... Hmm... I'm gonna try to figure out how I can do this. Uh... Because I will not be able to fit it in there. Um... Let me go with floor case. How many letters do I have? Yeah, I think I can do it. Or very abbreviated form. Oh, wait, no. I can't count. Uh, I am Cartoon Network, and my care, all of my Pokemon that I catch, will be named after good old fashioned Friday, Friday night cartoon, cartoon, whatever that night was, because I can't remember right now. Uh, cartoons like, you know, Dexter's Laboratory, Powerpuff Girls, Johnny Bravo, and all that stuff. So, Cartoon Network, that's your name. Ah, that's cool. This is my grandson. Um, I guess you guys hate each other. 
I f honestly fucking can't remember his name. What's his name? And your name will be... Not ass, or a uh, fart, or ass fart. Your name will be uh, Nick. Because Nickelodeon uh, was the biggest rival to Cartoon Network with their cartoon lineup way back when. That's right, I remember Nick. Um, yeah. Anyway, Cartoon Network, your very own Pokemon Legend is about to happen. World of Dreams, Adventures, whatever, and alcoholism waits. Let's go! Cartoon Network is playing the Super Nintendo. Wow. Oh, it's so old. And I remember I can withdraw. Oh my god, I can deposit items in the freaking PC. Oh, and I remember there's a potion in here. Jesus, this is so old. Alright. Well, I have basically explored this house. There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. I better go to on the railroad tracks. Hey, Mom. How's it going? Right. All boys leave home someday. It is said so on TV. Professor Oak next door is looking for you. Okay, cool. Here's an embarrassing thing back when I was a kid. I had no idea how to leave this fucking house. I I think I spent like a good five to ten minutes. I didn't realize the rug meant an exit because I'm either dumb or I don't know. I just didn't understand the whole Japanese something. Anyway, I'm just gonna go into this tall grass now. Hey, wait! Don't go out! <laughs> it's... <laughs> <sighs> it's unsafe. Wild Pokemon in, in there. You need your own Pokemon? Projection. I know. Uh, here, here, come with me, strange small child. Into my lab. Nothing creepy going on here. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Ugh. Nick? What the fuck are you? Oh, that's right! I- you're my grandson, and I called you, I guess? Here, Cartoon Network actual child that I remembered name to. There are three Pokémon here. Ah, they're inside these balls. When I was young, I was a serious ball master. I mean, Pokémon trainer. In my old age, I have only three left. The rest of them died. Anyway, if you can have one, choose. Hey, Gramps! What about me? Be patient, Nick! God damn it! Do you know how much alcohol I have to drink to forget that you exist? Anyway, you have one too. Oh, crap. That's right. Okay, so you want the fire poke? No. Um. Hmm. Crud. What do I. Ugh. Here we go. That probably sounded good. Um, so, to help me decide uh, which of these three five Pokemon, I'm, I'm taking a random throw the die. Literally, I am taking this die I have in my hand, and I'm going to see which Pokemon I get. If it's a one or two, it'll be Bulbasaur, so easy mode, at least near the beginning. Three and four, Squirtle. Wait, three and four... Charmander. I forgot which one is the order. Charmander. Three and four Charmander. Five and six. It'll be a Squirtle. Alright. And like a real big weeb that I am, I'm rolling a Japanese die because I have no life. It's a two! Oh, Bulbasaur. Where are you? No, I don't want the freaking turtle. You want this little turtle? No. Oh... Bulb's always been my always been my boy. I love him. So you want plant Pokemon Bulbasaur? Yes. This Pokemon's really energetic. Yay! Yes, I sure do. Your name is Ed. 
and you will love chickens. And buttered toast! <laughs> I guess I'll take this one then. The one that can easily murder you. Ha, sucks to be you, Broxon be a total bitch. Alright, see you, loser. Ha, wait, Cartoon Network! Let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Hey, Arnold will totally fucking wreck Dexter's lab! No, it's... Well, I mean, hey, Arnold's good, but... Anyway, Nickelodeon wants to fight me. Cool. Alright, he sent out Charmander. Sweet. Go, Ed! <laughs> Alright. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Oh, golly gosh. He used Growl on me. Oh, no. Whatever shall I do? I guess I'll just have to keep tackling him. You know, in hindsight, this first battle that they, they open up with uh, for most of the games is not really that exciting. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh, the critical hits. Oh, they are a cruel mistress, especially at the beginning. Uh, I can take at least one more. Oh, you decided to growl like a doofus. Alright, cool. I'm going to take advantage of that and start murdering you. Oh. My. God. Whew. Oh, that would be super embarrassing if I died at this. You see, if I didn't freaking pick up that potion, that'd be the end of this. I mean, I know it's like normal game. You don't have to worry about this bull, but I'm not. I'm playing on hardcore, man, and I gotta, gotta use whatever's available to you. <sighs> okay. Whatever. Just... Oh, thank you. Could have probably used that earlier. Yeah, I'm level 6. Woo. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I don't have a little uh, XP bar thing. I feed Nickelodeon. Ah! Unbelievable! I picked the wrong Pokemon! Ah, okay. I'll make Pokemon fight! Toughen them up! I'm take them to the gym. Gramps! Card Network, smell you later! <laughs> oh, okay. Well, while you're gone, I'm going to visit your hot sister. Even though she doesn't really look different from most other females. Hey, her network, Nick is out of Grandpa's lab. Oh, I can't. Oh, that's right. I gotta go to town first. Alright, so, extra thing. I will also be doing um, something probably... Uh, I'm probably going to regret it later. Something kind of stupid. So... Uh... So, I'm gonna leave my Pokemon thing on Shift, um, instead of Set. Shift is just, Shift is like what people normally play with. Every time it's like, this guy's setting out Nidoking, what, do you want to switch? I'm going to let it stay that way, because I've never really done a Nuzlocke Challenge. Me and a couple friends started doing Nuzlocke Challenge, but I've never fully done Nuzlocke Challenge, and I've never done, Nuzlocke, I've never done one on my own, at all. Uh, so... Sorry to anyone out there hoping to see a hardcore guy. Maybe after I've done this one, I'll do some even harder one. But I also will be using items in battle. Healing items. And I'm limiting myself to three per battle. So uh, I know that may sound like a lot. I've seen some people not use any items in battle. And a couple times I was like, wow, if they had used an item there, they could have survived, and this would have been a really, still would have been interesting Nuzlocke. I'm going to put three. I I want to try to stick by my guns and actually keep that as a thing. But that's, okay, that's what I'm saying right now. Three, I'm keeping it to shift, uh, because I do want to play this Nuzlocke challenge, and I really like to actually get through it, hopefully, and still make it interesting. And here's our first battle. Okay, this these first ones do not count because I technically don't have any Pokeballs to catch anything. So, I'm just going to murder some Pidgeys uh, and some Rattatas. And hopefully not get murdered. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, because they've got, a, it's got an advantage against me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. There you go. Just, just die, you stupid son. Uh, no. I'll talk to this weird kid. I ordered Pokemon Mart. Uh, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Yeah, I got a potion. Ooh. 
I know I sound so enthusiastic, don't I? <sighs> it just looks so goofy with this little buck teeth. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna whap my tail at you. Oh, fuck no! Yay. Oh, I learned, Ed learned leech seed. Yay. Cool. Move. Please move. Thank you. Oh, I still hit in battle. Oh, of course. There's going to be so much skipping in this game. Oh, we made it! Viridian City! Do, 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 do. It's Pokemon Center in every town ahead. They don't charge any money either, but that's cool, because they could really, really rake it in if they did. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We heal your Pokemon to perfect health. Shall we heal your Pokemon? Okay, cool. I promise I'm not going to do that all the time. Yeah, so anyway, uh, Bulbasaur. It's my favorite starter. He's always been my favorite starter. I uh, don't know, like, considering my whole channel, the whole thing is kaiju. Oh, hey, came from Pallet Town. How do you know that? You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Will you take it to him? Uh, I, oh, uh, well, I can't even, I guess I'll do that. Like, okay, so I had a Professor Oak for me. Have I seen this guy before? What's his story? Like, have I ventured out of my town? I'm assuming I haven't, considering I can't go through the tall grass. How do people get around Pokemon? Like, if this is the only way and it's got tall grass on it, do all Pokemon people have to have Pokemon and be Pokemon trainers? I mean, or are we isolated because none of those people can play Pokemon? They're just, I mean, fight with Pokemon and they're completely stuck there. Never be able to see anyone again, like their loved ones. So anyway, Bulbasaur is my favorite starter out amongst all the other guys. I, uh... Some would probably think that's a little weird, but I think, I don't know, I, I've always liked Bulbasaur. You know, Charmander becomes a crazy fire dragon. It's not a dragon, but you know. And, uh, Last Story is a crazy turtle with cannons on his back. But, I don't know, there's something about that frog dinosaur plant thing that I really love and have always loved. It's very endearing to me. Cartoon Network! How is my old Pokemon that I left for, with you for five minutes? Well, it seems like it likes you a lot. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. Or have a really big dick. Oh, what? You have something for me? Ho oh, ho! Oh, it's my parcel. No. Oh. I thought you were talking about something. Oh, this is a custom Pokeball I ordered. Thank you! Um. Yeah, what the heck? It's a custom Pokeball. It wasn't anything else. Why did I give him a custom Pokeball? What, what did any of that have to do with anything? I, for some reason, thought I remembered it was, like, the Pokedex that he got. But it isn't. So, uh, whatever. So, I just got, I, I delivered this shit to him, and then he gives me the Pokedex? That's, that's really dumb. Ah, uh, what'd you call me for? Ugh. All right, I have a request of you two. On the desk there is my invention, it's the Pokedex! It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen, or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Ah! Oh, sorry. Cartoon Network and Nick, take these with you! Yay! Make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world! That was my dream, and now I'm foisting it upon you because I have arthritis, scoliosis, and probably seven other horrible diseases. I want you two to fulfill my dream. Get moving, you two. I'm also not paying you. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history, and that's how you'll be repaid. As a little footnote in, 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 in history, because it's just going to say Professor Oak, helped by two children. Actually, fuck that. I'm not even saying that. All right, Gramps, leave it all to me. Uh, I'll prove, I'll, uh, I'll prove my worth. I'll finally get the love and the, the love and care I've always wanted from you because my father has always been absent. 
Cartoon Network, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. Wait, I hate to say it, but I don't... Maybe I misread that. Whatever, I probably did. I know. I'll borrow a timeout for my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one. Cartoon Network. <laughs> Fuck you. <sighs> I kind of understand why you never remember his name. Yeah, he's an asshole. Anyway, good luck. And guess what? I'm gonna visit your hot sister. Yeah, if I asked you to run an errand, here, this will help you. <sighs> wow. Back when we actually had to get the town map. Hmm. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Um uh hold on a second. Did we oh, I still don't have any balls. Ugh. I forgot. I'm so used to playing like Leaf Green, Fire Red, that, uh, and some, so many of the other games where they just basically hand you Pokeballs immediately after you've given the Pokedex and everything. But you have to walk all the way back to Viridian City, get a super Pokemon, hi there, may I help you? Would you like to buy these balls? Yes. Um, let's Whatever. Yes, I know, whatever, it's a lot of money. I won't care, yes, okay, cool. I probably shouldn't have spent all that. Oh, that's really cool. You give me you give me a free sample from your Pokemart, but you don't actually sell the potions here. Bunch of dumb assholes. <sighs> okay. Okay, here we are. All right. I've got a 50-50 chance, I think. I don't know what the percentages are in the old game. All right. Here we go. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Who's my first victim? It's Rattata! I mean... Whatever. I've always thought about using. You can't talk. A eradicate on my team. But I never did because you always get better Pokemon to use. So, uh. You know. This time, maybe I'll use. Ah, uh, God, I want to call it eradicate. That's. That's how you say it, Bryce. It's eradicate. Did I mention I'm tired? <laughs> Cartoon Network uses Pokeball. Ah, oh, I gotta capture you for my... I gotta make you a new IP for one of my new shows. All right, yeah, I caught him. I caught a rat. Oh, I feel so good about myself. All right, new Pokedex entry has been added. Bites anything when it attacks. Small and very quick. It is common sight in many places. Hmm. Yes, I do want to give it a nickname. Uh... And, um, mm, trying to think, I kind of want to call it, no, that'd be dumb, um, I think I'm going to call you, I don't think there's any other Pokemon in this game that I'm going to get that are going to be even close. I am... Weasel. I am Weasel. Yes. Aw. Uh, I can't remember if you can catch Mankey on that route over there, but that'd be cool, and then I could get IR Baboon. Nah, that's just kidding. I have a better name for them anyway. Cool. I have two little guys in my party. <sighs> no, 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 no. I don't want, I don't want to do this again. 
Well, my team's healed up, and um, I'm ready to go. So, this seems like a good stopping point. So, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this first episode, and I will definitely continue it. And we're going to see how far Cartoon Network can make it. Will Nickelodeon prevail? No. <laughs> it's a trick question. Neither of them do. Kaiju 101, I'll see you at some point. Bye-bye.